everyone, I'm Lisa Broadway Fangirl Extraordinaire and thanks for joining me for a very special episode of PNC Broadway and Columbus's Broadway Dish. I am joined by Columbus's own and star of Hairspray, Andrew Levette. Hello. Andrew, thanks for joining I'm, me again. I'm so excited to be in your car. Look at all these cameras. I'm so excited to have you. I think you're our first return oh carpool my gosh. karaoke guest. Oh my gosh, I have to be the one who does it the most. So let me know. Done. <laughs> Done. So I'm going to take you over to the Ohio Theater okay, and we'll just chat and maybe sing a song or two along the way. Sound <sighs> good? Don't make me sing. <laughs> Don't make me sing. <laughs> so Andrew, you opened the show on Tuesday night to a hometown crowd. Yeah. Tell me what it was like that first moment you appeared on the stage of the Ohio. I was holding my, my, um, my laundry up. <laughs> And I could feel the energy of the audience, and I just was like shaking a little bit. I mean, it's so exciting to be home and to be on that stage. It feels really full circle. And you know what's even crazier is like closing the show with You Can't Stop the Beat is so... <laughs> I have done that specific song in drag at Access oh Nightclub. Oh my gosh. Prob I, mean, for, I mean, I closed almost every major production show that I did uh, for maybe almost you know, five to ten years with You Can't Stop the Beat. It's really been a part of my life in so many different ways, and so to be just a few blocks down the street at the historic Ohio Theater, performing that song that I did up the street at the very beginning of my drag career is, I mean, it's just this really crazy full circle moment. You can't stop the beat Ever since this whole world began A woman found out if she shook it She can shake up a man And so I'm gonna shake and shimmy It's the best that I can today You can't stop the motion of the ocean Or the sun and the sky You can wonder if you wanna But I'll never ask why You can try to hold me down I'm gonna spit in your eye and say You can't stop the beat Fetch the oxygen now <laughs> <laughs> so Harvey was obviously iconic yeah. in the role. Yeah. How do you take that and make it your own? Because you truly do. Oh, uh, you know, I was wanting to honor him, but also not do Harvey. And so a lot of people were asking me, are you going to do the voice? Are you going to do the voice? And I was like, oh, people expect me to sound like Harvey. Or they expect me to sound like John Travolta, who put a, a crazy Baltimoreese to it. which. Right. I, which didn't feel authentic to me, you know? And I, I, I wasn't gonna be, oh, hon, oh, hon. I just, I, that wasn't my version of her, right. of Edna. And so my biggest hurdle was just to get over the fact that Harvey was Edna and was won the Tony. And, you know, in the rehearsal process, uh, Jack O'Brien was like, okay, stop trying and just let it go. He said, you're not gonna mess it up. And I, and I just needed to hear that. And then I was working through it and I really was finding a lot of success. And then Harvey reached out to me and provided a lot of insight and encouragement and it changed everything. It's almost as if I didn't need Harvey's blessing, mm -hmm. but I wanted to ensure that I was honoring the story, honoring the character, and also honoring the people who, who did it before me. Right. Specifically Divine and Harvey. Uh, uh, oh, woke up today feeling the way I always do. That's high. Uh, uh, oh, hungry for something that I can't eat. When I hear the beat, that rhythm of sound that's calling me down. It's like a message from high above. Uh, uh. Oh, pulling me out to the smiles and the streets that I love. Good morning, Baltimore. You know, it is one of the best books of a musical ever written. It is one of the best scores of a musical ever written. This, the show is so good. And it's like hit after hit after hit. Bop after bop. Every single song. Well, and I love that this uh, song is such a love letter to Baltimore. Mm -hmm. And you returning is a love letter to Columbus. Yeah, so yeah. Where are you sending the cast when they say, Andrew, what do I have to do in Columbus? Oh my gosh. So, what are like the top three things that you tell them? Well, I created a whole like city sheet <laughs> for the entire company. <laughs> I mean, it depends on like what the categories are vast, honey. So, <laughs> like, I recommended things like, 
my gosh, my Jenny's, obviously, I think everyone obviously. should have a Jenny's ice cream experience. I think everyone should try, um, you know, exploring the short north and exploring uh, that wonderful uh, district. And Columbus is so, I mean, yes, they experience this audience, which is such an, an incredible joy. And we've never had an audience like these audiences. I mean, what? I mean, not like these. I mean, <laughs> Hairspray is a show that everyone gets up out of their, out of their seat at the end right. of the show and they dance. But these, this, this incredibly boy, like boisterous, joy-filled, loud, embracing audience. We have not had them. I mean, we've had them, but not like this. And Edna, you got me going hot and heavy. You're fat and old, but baby, boring you ain't. Some folks don't get it, but we never fret it, cause we know the time is our friend. And it's plain to see you're stuck with me until the bitter end. And we got a kid who's blowing the lid off the Turnblad family tree. You'll always hit the spot, big shot. Ooh, you're timeless to me. Now you spend your nights as Edna. <laughs> yeah, I do. But you are a busy man. Hey! <laughs> Just this past week, yeah. a children's book, yeah. a cameo in a movie. Yeah. A lot of firsts. <laughs> a lot of firsts. What's all like that? What's like that been like? It's really overwhelming because like the children's book uh, has been a process of three years in the making, you know? So it started in 2019 and you know, it's a, it takes a long time for those projects to happen. Yeah. And and then I I have a cameo in Weird, and I play Divine, Weird, the Weird Al Yankovic story, which is on Roku now, available on Roku, free to download and free to watch. That's right. Um, <laughs> uh, and I play Divine, so it's another weird intersection with my life in this world of created by John Waters. And the reason I I don't I mean I, I was that's another project that I was asked to be a part of. I didn't audition for oh it. Oh my god! Um, they they called and said we want you for this, and I. I'd never done a motion picture. I love Dan, Rad Dan Radcliffe, mm -hmm. Daniel Radcliffe. I love him. I was a fan before I had the chance to work with him and, and you know, be able to even say friend. Um, and Al Yankovic, I listened to when I was a kid. But it's all overwhelming because, <clears throat> excuse me, it's all happening at once, all while I'm coming home to Columbus after a year on the road with Hairspray. And... Do you feel like maybe <clears throat> the stars just align and this is what was I don't know, you know? You know, uh, yeah, probably. I'm, yeah, it's weird. It's just weird, Lisa. It's wonderful. <laughs> it's wonderful and well, weird. Weird like the movie. No one more deserving. And <laughs> Thank Columbus you. Columbus is so proud to see you succeeding and Thank the you. biggest fan club here. I mean, it's, uh, I'm really grateful for the city sticking with me in all these different incarnations of my career and like versions of myself and, um, you know, allowing me the space and the room to grow and to call this city home and to have people proudly exclaim that I'm from Columbus and I live in Columbus because I do. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like, but like I know, I am very, very, very aware of my, where my success lies and it could not be possible without this community. Andrew, thank you so much for joining me today. I had so much fun with you. Are you, you. kidding? I, it's so good to be home. <laughs> it's so good to be with you. And it's so good to be back at the Ohio Theater. We got a show tonight. I got to get ready. Yeah. And don't miss Andrew. Ah, you better come see us. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. Don't miss Hairspray playing now through Sunday at the Ohio Theater. For tickets, visit broadwayandcolumbus.com. And that's it for this week's episode of PNC Broadway and Columbus's Broadway Dish. We'll see you again next week. Bye. A lot of inspiration has come from my mom. Um, Does she see parts of her in it? <laughs> I don't think she wants to say that. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> mom, if you're watching, you're not any inspiration at all to make her happy. <laughs>